catch up with the United Way, and of course that means director Andy Green. And Andy, you say it's a big day today. Yeah, uh, today is the first day of six uh, presentation days. So all of the so in the United Way we uh, fund you know around twenty. I think right now we're at twenty one, twenty two. Uh, uh, agencies, not nonprofits, throughout the county, and uh, every year those agencies have to uh, request funding, and then they have to do presentations for a group of volunteers and uh, community leaders. And uh, today is our first day of uh, presentations. Talk a little bit about the presentations. Uh, how do they work? Yeah, so we have in, in the alley we have like three branches of how we uh, categorize everything, and that's. Uh, education, health and wellness, and financial stability. Um, so all of our agencies fit within one of those uh, branches, and, and then we have three weeks of presentations, and each one focuses on one of those topics. So this week is health and wellness, and uh, we have you know a panel of uh, uh, between six to eight people, and, uh, and then any board members that want to show up as well. And then uh, a, a agency will come in, they have uh, 20 minutes, so that's like, you know, 15 for presenting, five for questions. And uh, they uh, present to the panel on what they do and why they should get uh, funding. Now, you've been here better than a year, so you were part of this process last year. This is my third year. Third one? Okay. Yeah. So uh, what have you learned during the time period? Oh, wow. Um, every year is, I mean, everything is always different, right? Uh, so the first year, it was very much... I guess the, the ongoing lesson is not only how much need there is in the community, because there's a lot of need. You know what I mean? We're and and we're only we're only able to do so much, right? Mm -hmm. But the there are people that are out there working to to help people. And I think that's the best part. Mm -hmm. So as much need there is in the community, um, every like everything is being uh, worked on yeah now you talked that there is a panel a review panel now is it the same panel that with all of these review processes now, each week is a different group of people okay yeah yeah and um every uh agency has to apply so you know that the panels they get the applications and then every um panelist is uh is assigned an agency to meet with and talk to, you know, before the presentation, some okay. do it after the presentation, maybe go on site. Um, but, uh, you know, we really like to look at all these agencies, like, you know, 360 degrees and, and see what they're doing. Again, visiting with Andy Greeny, the United Way. So just starting the review process, when it is completed, what steps are taken then? Yeah, so uh, we have three weeks of review, and, and every uh, agency is, uh, you know, kind of, graded throughout that process by a, each um, uh, committee member. And then uh, in the coming weeks after, like you know, about mid-May, uh, we'll look at how much money we're able to distribute to the agencies and how much money, uh, and then they will uh, look at all of the grading and see uh, how to distribute that, that funding uh, throughout those agencies. You know, and we, we do it by the three weeks so we break it down by you know we have a giant pot you know and then we break it down by uh there's a whole algorithm that's way <laughs> way smarter than me uh to figure out some of that stuff but uh so the the groups that are uh you know the the different weeks are looking at just the the people that they they saw now the cool part about this process is that uh through these algorithms uh we're not having agencies compete against each other mm. the agencies are only competing against themselves and so it's not like mm. we're like hey uh you know the the ymca did uh did great this year they're number one and uh, information referrals number two they, the process does not work like that mm. uh they uh they're only against uh each other so when this entire process has been completed and you've done all the algorithms do you just give them a big check, or how does that work? Is yeah, there some so, kind of a presentation? No. Uh, in June, every agency will get a letter that states what their allocation is for the year. And then we have four checks that come out. And the first check doesn't come out until December. And then it's quarterly in the year. But so for right now, they're, um, 
ba- you know, asking for funding for 2025. Okay. And so it's uh, funding that will come starting in December. Yeah. I know it's been difficult not only for the United Way, but for a lot of agencies after COVID. Yeah. And if people still would like to contribute to the United Way, I'm sure they can. Oh, oh, 100%. Uh, we have uh, uh, United Way, ClintonUnitedWay.org. Um, that's our uh, website. You can give through there. We're also, you know, we're down at the U.S. Bank Building. You can call us, 563-242-1209. Uh, uh, we are always accepting uh, uh, funding. Okay, yeah. so now you are so very involved, as you pointed out, with nonprofits. Yeah. And you just recently completed a summit. Tell us yeah. about that. Oh, it was it was great. We looked at um, uh Boards and uh, you know nonprofits relationships with their boards, but also you know also who's right for your board, and uh, what was uh, kind of great about this one, you know uh, we were gonna we were talking about maybe bringing in someone to like talk about boards and uh, have like a guest speaker, and then uh, we decided well what if we just had you know everybody in the room is kind of an, an expert in their own way what if we had everybody kind of uh, talk. Uh, about their own experience and what they're looking for, and uh, and you know that's kind of a that's kind of a coin flip when you're you're bringing into a, people in a room to be like, okay, now you're going to talk. But we had this awesome conversation, mm-hmm. and we had three different uh, questions throughout the time that we were there. I don't remember what all those were, but uh, there was always conversation flowing, and it was it was really really good. Um, summit. Do you have a moderator then, somebody who kind of really conducts the uh, the summit? Um, so uh, between like uh, Ann Eisenman and myself and Matt Parves, okay. uh, we're usually we're usually uh, the ones kind of in the middle there. But we also, you know, we'll, we'll call the people in uh, and uh, have people help out. But at this one, it was kind of Ann and I kind of directing everything. Yeah, getting busy with Andy Green. So. How did this all come about? I, I know it hasn't been that long that these summits have been taking yeah. place. Um, so yeah, it was the it was around Christmas in twenty one, which I moved here in December of twenty one. So I mean, it was really quick after I moved here, and I ran into Ann at uh, High V on like Christmas Eve, and I was like, I want to talk some time about, you know, just uh, nonprofit stuff, and she's like. What if we have ever eat nonprofit meet together? So then that became the first nonprofit summit in June of 22. Okay. And then through that nonprofit summit, it was decided that they want to do one every, you know, every quarter, or every so often. Um, and and uh, and we've been doing them ever since. Now is this countywide participation, yeah. Andy? Oh okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. We definitely, and we have, we've definitely had people from like Dewitt and Comanche. We're still working on getting the, you know, the other side of the county in. Yeah. Um, but it's definitely countywide. Okay. Yeah. Again, appreciate your time as always. You'll be back here again on May 15th. Yeah. And so what are we all going to talk about when we get to the middle of next month? Oh, we got, you know, it's uh, summertime uh, coming up, and so there's always uh, stuff uh, happening throughout the summer, with, especially with all of our nonprofits putting on different events, uh, different uh, social activities, and so we'll have a whole docket of uh, summer stuff coming up. Very oh, and also school supplies. Yeah. There you go. School oh, yeah, supplies. that's right. <laughs> yeah. All right, hey, Andy, thank you so much. Hey, thank you, brother. It's a bird. It's a plane. The, the, the Dan Patrick Show. Dan Patrick. Yeah. I think it was last week.